हेलो एंड वेलकम टू इट्स टुमारो न्यूज एंड आई एम हेना तलाटी अ वॉल्केनो ऑन साउथ वेस्टर्न जापान आइलैंड इरप्टेड अर्ली वेडनर्सडे सेंडिंग लार्ज रॉक्स ऑलमोस्ट वन किलोमीटर फ्रॉम द क्रेटर एंड प्रॉम्प्टिंग द वेदर एजेंसी टू रेज इट्स अलर्ट लेवल टू रिस्ट्रिक्ट पेपर्स एंट्री टू द एरिया सराउंडिंग द माउंटेन दिस वॉल्केनिक इरप्शन हैज अकर्ड ऑन एन आइलैंड इन द साउथ वेस्टर्न जैपनीज प्रिफ्रैक्चर ऑफ कागोशिमा The Japan Meteorological Agency said the eruption took place on Suwano Sejima in the early morning on Wednesday. The explosive eruption hurled the large rocks to a distance of nearly 1 km from the Otake crater. The agency has raised its volcanic alert level from 2 to 3 on its fight tire scale meaning that people should not approach the mountain. They are warning about possibility of large rocks falling on the areas within 2 km of the crater the agency warned of the potential for big rocks being hurled on the air within the 2 km radius of the crater of the mountain in toshima village 2 suwano sejima has experienced occasional volcanic activities the alert level of this volcano was raised to 3 in december 2020 and in march this year after the eruption sent large rocks about 1 km from the crater suwano is a volcanic island with a small population of 84 people as of wednesday is located about 230 km south southwest of kagoshima prefecture the 799 meter volcano has been active with the alert level raised temporarily due to the other eruptions in the past year since monday a total of 27 eruptions have occurred at the crater according to the weather agency In 1813 a major eruption destroyed nearly all the houses in the area and forced all the residents to evacuate the island for some 70 years according to the official website of Toshima village there were no immediate reports of injuries during this current eruption according to local authorities despite there being a small residential area some 4 kilometers from the crater A volcanic activity is difficult to predict even when it is closely monitored but researchers now believe a crater's age might offer clues with older volcanoes producing less frequently but larger and more dangerous eruptions when a volcano is not old and is just starting to be active its reservoir is rather small and surrounding crust is relatively cold which leads to many frequent but small and rather predictable eruptions however it is different story with the old volcanoes the reservoir is bigger and the rocks around them are hotter when new magma is injected it does not generate much over the pressure because the rocks around the reservoir deform and growth continues eventually the accumulation of the large amounts of the magma will lead to large eruptions there are currently 1500 active volcanoes in the world and about 50 of them erupt each year japan has over 100 active volcanoes which is more than almost any other country and accounts alone for about 10% of active volcanoes in the world the volcanoes belong to the pacific ring of fire caused by the subduction zones of the pacific plate beneath the continental and other oceanic plates along its ma- japan is located at the junction of four tectonic plates the pacific philippine eurasian and north american plates and its volcanoes are mainly located on five subduction zone related volcanoes arcs where the pacific plates descends under the north american plate along the coral trench and the japan trench and the underneath the philippine sea plate along the isobonin trench the philippine plate itself subducts beneath the eurasian plate at the western end forming the ryukyu trench that's all for now for more news updates stay tuned with us it's tomorrow news hena talati for more weather updates like this and please subscribe our channel